body. So right now it is actually 10:18. Hi, Bubba Bear. You come say hi. <laughs> okay, bye. I start a two-day trip tomorrow, but my sign-in time is actually 5 a.m. <laughs> I'm trying to get ready now and go to sleep because I need to be up at 3 a.m. I actually moved my uniform and all of my stuff to kind of get ready into the spare bedrooms. That way I don't wake my husband up as I'm getting ready. And I've already packed up my entire suitcase other than the things to get ready like my toothbrush, toothpaste, and makeup. So all of that should be good to go. I've got my extra camera battery on the charger. My tablet is charging up right now. I have my watch on the charger as well. And last but not least, I have my little carry-on all packed up. So this is actually my newest Minky Blue bag. This is the new version of it. So I will actually be using this on my trip and then I will be reviewing it and doing a full video of all of the changes and the exciting stuff after I get to use it and see how it all holds up. So yeah, I'm gonna get to bed and I will give you like the full itinerary and our flight schedule tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, good morning. So it is 4.41 in the morning. The only reason I have any energy is because I've already had my coffee this morning. Our sign-in time is 5 a.m. Today we are doing two flights. We are going from Dallas to Miami and then Miami to Cancun where I believe we have like a 16 hour layover. But since I have less than 20 minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and get my stuff and get inside and let's get checked in and go through security, temperature screening and all that good stuff. Sun is coming up. Are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow. Yo, we'll lose my law. I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go where you go. I'll take you to a place we can see it all. Step off the edge, I can break your fall. We'll lose my law. I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go where you go. So one of the good things about being here so early is there is literally nobody here yet. It's like a ghost town. Even the guy at security said I was the first victim. <laughs> On the plane right now so I am going to get everything set up I'm working at the back galley today so I'm gonna get things set up I'm gonna do my safety checks and then we are flying over to Miami and then to Cancun <laughs> so one of the first things we always like to do is make sure that catering has given us everything so we go ahead and give everything a good look We're gonna break up some ice. Looks like we have a bucket and everything ready to go in case anybody needs anything. We're still not doing a full service, but it is on demand. So that's why we go ahead and set some stuff up, but you don't have to set everything up like a typical service of a flight attendant would. <laughs> So we just finished our first Miami flight. It was completely full. I was like, it's 5 a.m., what are all y'all doing here? But now we are actually connecting, we're switching planes over, and we are going to Cancun now. This plane is cold. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my stuff up. I can see that catering is just not leaving. So let's get ready to go. <laughs> We are all done now, so we're gonna go ahead and go through customs and head to the hotel. We finally made it to the hotel. 
here's our fabulous room i don't know if y'all remember from the last time i stayed here a few weeks ago but if you don't i'll refresh your memory <laughs> here's the room and it has a suite the bathroom is behind me and i come down the stairs all right oh my gosh the water this is my favorite part right here with the balcony oh. look how blue that water is it's just absolutely insane it's like every single time i come here i'm just as impressed as the last time i was here so pretty there's a lot more people in the water this time too Okay, so here's the plan. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and go downstairs. I'm gonna get dressed ready and go down by the beach to get lunch and some drinks and enjoy the layover. We have almost 17 hours, which is fabulous, but we're gonna have an early morning. I think it's like a 4.25, no, it's a 4.30 shuttle time. <laughs> But anyways, um, we're not gonna think about that. We are gonna enjoy the here, the now. So right now it is 12.55 local time. So I'm gonna go down there with one of my flight attendants and hang out. Her mom is actually coming to meet her. So we're gonna eat and do whatever. And then I think maybe the other flight attendants are gonna come meet us out there. So I think we're really gonna just be like enjoying the beach and hanging out and it's just gonna be the vibe. So y'all know how I am. First things first, gotta get the uniform hung up and put away. Okay, so I am all dressed and ready so i'm just waiting on megan to finish up she said she's almost done and then we're gonna go ahead and head downstairs okay our ride is here dun, 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 dun. oh my gosh y'all okay i guess we should pick a floor we're going to the lobby all right we're here hello hello so this is megan hello so we came to the bar right next to the ocean to do food so the margaritas just came out how is it great <laughs> <laughs> so the ceviche came out and i totally forgot to film it's good just to let you know and she got mini fajita tacos they're so cute <laughs> So Dion and I found this cute little spot. It's supposed to be reserved, but they gave it to us. And here is our amazing view. So after we finished up at the beach, it was absolutely beautiful. We decided to go into town and do dinner. So I went with Megan and her mom and we found this little taco spot and we ended up getting like the chips and salsa at the beginning. And then we got margaritas and I believe her mom got a strawberry uh, mojito. And then we got some tacos. It was okay. The restaurant that I went to last time in Cancun, I believe it's called like Regio's, was definitely better, but I still wasn't mad at it. It was still pretty good. And after that, we went over to a souvenir shop and just saw all the trinkets and all the fun stuff. It was definitely worth going and seeing everything. Oh, that feels so good, y'all. So I'm ready for bed. I know it's early, but we have a 3 a.m. wake up, so I guess I will see you guys tomorrow. So I've been getting ready. So right now it's like, I don't know, 3.45. Let me just, let me just. Uh, so today we are doing three flights. So today we are going from Cancun back to Dallas. And then we are doing a Texas twirl. So we are going Dallas to Austin, Austin back up to Dallas. Okay, so I'm all ready, but it's like so bittersweet to me. Like this could very well be my last international trip for a really long time. Oh, all right, let's take one last look at the view and then we gotta go downstairs and check out and get ready to get the shuttle. Okay, there's not much of a view right now. <laughs> look at all the condensation. I mean, you can literally feel it in the room. Like my stuff, even my uniform feels kind of wet. It's kind of gross, but, but. Oh. Goodbye Cancun. Oh, definitely going to miss this and layovers like this. My camera's fogging up. <laughs> very, very, very bittersweet, but let's go downstairs before we end up a crying mess and check out <laughs> try to let her go because she won't be mine i listen when she talks i watch her when she walks she's giving me these feelings that i've never
never felt before But she will never know that Taking last looks so and saying our goodbyes And I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know, na na All right, is here So they have all the refreshments out. I think I'll get a water. They usually have a hot breakfast, but we're too early. <laughs> Okay, so I'm in the back alley today. Catering just left, and so we checked everything with them, signed off, we're good to go, and now we are gonna head to our flight in Dallas. <laughs> We just finished up our first of three flights. Um, we were about 30 minutes delayed getting in due to weather we had to go around. So now it's time to go through customs and then get ready for our second flight. We are now on the plane, but we're getting a little bit of Murphy's Law here. So when we went through customs, the line was so long, so it took forever. Now we're already delayed. And then when we were going back through security, we got a random. And then we had to hurry up and get food because there's no sit time, there's nothing to eat until we're done with Austin. So we made it with two minutes to spare and I picked up a salad. But as soon as we got onto the plane, now the PA system in the front is not working. But here's the salad that I picked up. Baby, it's a big dark world. You don't need to know about that. Don't need to know about that. I'll protect you with my life. We are all done. Today felt like forever. We are actually back on time. It all worked out, but when we got to Austin, we basically had to hustle because we had to like turn and burn really quickly, but we are on time. Here she is, yes. <laughs> and here's that wonderful sweater that I totally forgot. <laughs> all right, y'all, let's get on out of here. Woo! Ugh, I'm ready to get into my finest pajamas. <laughs> okay, let's go. We're home. Hi, Bobby. Hi. How are you sleeping? Look at the cute face. Hi, I missed you so much. Okay, look out, world. I have on the finest of pajamas. <laughs> now, I am just comfy and ready to go. I think I'm going to take a nap, but thank you so much for joining me. Please give this video a big old thumbs up, press that subscribe button, leave me a comment, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.